Okay, welcome back, Portugal, to your Caribou Data Science channel. This is the afternoon of uh, uh, what October the seventh, twenty twenty, and, and it is time for your daily COVID nineteen analysis. Before we get started, I want to give a oh, I want to give a big shout out to oh man, hang on a second here. I closed the wrong thing. Let's just come back over and take a look at exactly what your numbers are looking like. I take a look and see how many how many of you folks in Portugal watched this video yesterday. Of course, you know the good news about my videos is, you know, the plots I use are very are. If you look at the plots I use, it, it is obvious what's going on with the data. I mean, it, it's obvious that if uh, if the line is going up or the bars are going up, then that means there's more cases or more deaths. And you don't really you don't even need to understand English to understand that. It's just it's just uh. I mean, if you if you if you if you're familiar with any plots, okay, it doesn't make any difference. You, know, you should be fine. So anyway, Portugal. So yesterday, uh, uh, the seventh. Uh, well, actually, numbers for the previous 24 hours, you had two views. Now, what's interesting is the two views came from people under the age of 18. Okay. So th so again, you know, thanks so much for all those views. I, I, pre I even even I even appreciate each one. Because I know that you all have something more that you could, but you, something else you could be doing with your time rather than watching my videos. So I do appreciate each one of those. Now, before we get started, here are a couple of requests. Uh, first of all, click on the subscribe button, then click on the like button, and then finally click on the share button. Share this video on Facebook and Twitter. You can also share the link to this video onto an email or text message. And finally, you know, if you click on this on this on the description button, you're going to see two different links. If you're interested in data analytics in our program, I mean, the first link to Twitch is, is for you. 8 p.m. and 8 p.m. tonight, I'll be doing a live Twitch stream. Um, uh, for, uh, uh, but the subject is almost always data analytics. Secondly, I'm trying to start a YouTube channel, so I'd appreciate it if you would click on the on on the Twitter. No, I'm trying to start a Twitter channel. So I would appreciate if you would click on that Twitter channel link and follow me on Twitter this evening, okay? Let's just get started here then. So what you can see is, you know, you, you've obviously had a pretty aggressive uh, vaccination program. Over 8 million people have been vaccinated so far, okay? Which brings your vaccination total percent up to almost 80, up to like, I think it's like 88% maybe. If we look at the cases, this is what doesn't, doesn't quite make sense to me. I don't understand why this, these numbers are so smooth there. Because if you look at the numbers otherwise, that isn't the case. Okay? Okay. But nonetheless, you have this long declining pattern in cases. Then you had an increase back in July. Now, it appears to be, now cases appear to be declining again. And what about deaths? Your deaths have basically fallen off the edge of a cliff. I mean, these, since April, your your deaths have been just crazy low from COVID-19. Okay, that's all we can really say about this point. So again, before I let you folks in Portugal, first of all, thank you to all the people who watched the video yesterday. But of course, you know, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and, sh and click on the share button. Share the video today with your friends and family. And again, if you click on the description, you're going to see two links. If you're interested in our program in data analytics, then, then click on that Twitch link tonight at 8 p.m. And I'll be doing Dave's Data Analytics channel live on Twitch. Secondly, I'm trying to start a Twitter channel. So I'd appreciate if you, if you click on that link for Twitter and follow me on Twitter today. Thanks so much for your time. Portugal, we'll see you tomorrow with an update report.